This is a report of Midjourney News for the week, ending January 27, 2024. I'll leave a link to a document containing a transcript summary of this update, along with prompts for Midjourney version 6 images used in this video. The background images this week were created in the style of artist Olympia Zagami. The main source of this news summary is the Mid-Journey Office Hours event, led by David Holes, the CEO of Mid-Journey, on Wednesday, January 17. Let's start with updates regarding planned or committed near-term features. The big news this week is that InPainting, Zoom and Pan were released for version 6 Alpha on Wednesday, depending on your time zone. The new in-painting and zoom features that came with this release operate in the same manner as version 5.2. However, the V6 pan feature has been reworked and enhanced. In version 5.2, the pan feature increased the size and pixels of the image as the canvas expanded. In version 6, pan maintains the same image resolution, such that the frame is simply extended to the left or right up or down as you direct with the pan buttons. The rework produces panned images with improved coherence and more predictability, especially when you are performing portrait-oriented or vertical pans. I have a link to a video in the description area demonstrating the newly released features. Niji V6 is scheduled for release on Monday, the 29th of January. It is in final testing and tuning. The remaining Niji efforts are focused on speed and quality improvements. David mentioned that the Niji V6 image results are looking very good. There were a few updates on uncommitted V6 features. Work and testing are continuing for a consistent style feature, but it is not ready for a release date commitment. The model will be that of style image references. For example, you'll be able to provide, mid-journey, with a reference image that models a style you wish to apply to new images. The system is being tested by guides and mods. Current thinking is that the new style reference system will be released in early February. A new describe feature is in development. David mentioned that the goal is for an image generated from new describe output tokens to match the input image with much greater accuracy than the old describe feature. A version of the new describe feature could come out as early as next week. Website development efforts are focused on finalizing features, harmonizing design, and completing the onboarding process. Ongoing redesigns are for simplicity, consistency, and ensuring a user-friendly experience. It was mentioned that the Alpha website access would be expanded to the 5K Club this week. David also mentioned that the next few weeks will be really exciting in terms of feature releases and updates. I hope you enjoyed this week's summary of Midjourney News. Just a reminder that you'll have a link to a document with a news summary and prompts for the Midjourney V6 images. Thanks for your continued interest and support. See you again soon. Bye-bye.